Ah, block robot. Okay, this one, as far as I can tell, is really luck-based. Uh, it's random what they have you go with, what spawns and how you have to play it. Uh, essentially, whatever color spawns, you want to catch it with that block and then bring it over, uh, but you're going to need to bring a, a, a combo, a couple combos, in order to get this done. So, all right, green. So I send the, the green block. Give it a try. Let him run, and then he just kind of hangs out here, waiting for the next one to go. Hey, another green! Perfect! This is what I call like a natural combo. Um, I I'm gonna hope for those. Hey! What do you know? I'm getting lucky. Uh, that might actually be enough for me to actually win this now. To be honest, that, that could do it. Okay, but I'm gonna go for this anyway. Put that there. Let go of that. Bring that over and run. And that's how you build up a, a kind of normal combo there. Um, if they give you a natural, of course, take advantage of that. But if they don't, obviously you're not gonna be able to. Um. But yeah, we're, we're, we're good here. I'm making this one look easy because I got lucky. Because I'm getting very, very lucky. All right, so essentially you want to catch one and then bring them. I think you guys get the idea. I think you guys get it. Uh, some of them will be difficult to do, though, uh, based on where it is. Like if they give you a purple first and then a, and then a green, that's not really a combo you can do. So you just kind of have to settle for what they get you sometimes. That's the issue. Yeah, like here, uh, I have to bring the professor along and get him out of the way of that red, otherwise he will be knocked down. But this next one I can do. And let him die. That's not what I anticipated doing, but that's what ended up happening. Sorry, professor. Sorry about that. All right. And then run. But, you know, I have more than enough here. They gave me more than enough to do this. Okay, let's wait, and then there, and there. Uh, That is not what I wanted to do. Sorry, Alan, now you get to die. <laughs> Did he say cheat would be dying? <laughs> like, seriously? And then for it. All right, another combo. Not that I necessarily need it. Bring that over. Bring that over, and I've I've Finally solved it. They were very lucky. They were well. I was lucky. They were very forgiving to me early on, so it was pretty easy for me to get that done. A lot of times, they just give you things that you can't build combos on. There's not much to be said otherwise. That's all you can do. All right, this one ladder lottery. You just need to figure out how this works. You can drop down from three different spots. Uh, you can drop down on the far right. It'll take you to the purple switch there. Uh, you can drop down the middle, it'll take you to the green, and then you can drop down over here, and then here you have the option of blue and red. And then there's switches down here, but the switches down here um, are really for transport. That That's really all they're for. You don't need to um, worry about them falling off once they're down there. Um, th that's it, that's it. So let me try to show it off a little bit. We'll start off with the professor. I do need to bring him over and uh we'll just bring him all the way over there and then he's good that's it that's all i need to do for him wait for him to go and then they give you enough you don't need to build up a combo here don't worry about that all right so scott needs to go here and then he can start running um purple can just run as is okay um I need to put that there so that he can go across. All right, red is where things get difficult. Okay. So, yeah, you can see Miyuki hanging out over there. She can hang out there all day. I don't care. And then bring you across. And put you there, and you're good. Okay. We'll put you there. 
And then you go across. Once again, once they're down on the bottom, they're not really at risk of falling down by looping back and forth in the back there. So you can leave them there all you want. And there you go. So this is the finish line. That's it. It's a little bit easier now that I know what I'm doing. Now that I know what I'm doing, seemingly it's kind of easy. This one, though, this one's not easy for me. All right, this one's the hard one for me. This is called side shot. Essentially, the problem here is that I need to build up a combo. I like doing the reds as the combo. Problem is that that usually means I need to hold on to things quite a bit. Okay, so uh, green, like you can build up a combo anywhere really, but I like doing it on red because it's kind of the first one there. All right, we'll spawn you in. Uh, you, I just need to knock off here. There you go. There you go. You can run. You're not giving me any reds to build up the combo. That's gonna make things difficult for me. Ah, crap. So this is the finish line. Okay, there's the red. Now I need to start building the combo, and that's how you do it. You hold the red. Really you wanna do this. Okay, and hit. All right, we got it. We got it. You have to be careful with that sometimes, otherwise it's not going to work. Okay. I should be able... Uh, this is going to be difficult. Especially with Alan there. Crap. Bring you... Mm -hmm. Okay. We'll try it again. We got blue coming. Great. One of every color. Why not? Great. Now I've screwed it up entirely. This is the finish line. Uh, it's it's when I build up. It's when I try to build up combos. That's when things start going badly for me. The universe is safe. That's when things start going badly. All right. Block you off. Is that going to be close enough? No. Finally made it. That's not gonna be close enough. Made it. All right, I got a combo there. I'm not sure. Is that gonna be close? That is. Do I dare try to build up the combo? I think I have to. I think I have to. The problem is that he wants to turn like right there. That's the problem. One of many problems. One of many problems. All right, we'll we'll wait. Knock you off. The peace of the universe is safe. All right, I'm just gonna have to sacrifice the Al in here to get the combo. Didn't get the combo like I wanted, but uh, I'll take what I can get. All right, well, we got another combo, but that's gonna only get me up to 21 total, even if they give me the combo here, which they do. But that only gives me 21. Like I said, it's a little bit of luck on this one. This is the one that even when I know what I'm doing, I'm going to struggle with it because of uh, failure to execute properly. We'll try again now. We will try again. Well, I guess I'll give it a try. Once again, I, I should try to build up combos in order to do that. I don't want to run. I also shouldn't have spawned it as soon as I did. All right, let's just get you across. Okay, now start running. Start running. Okay, walk. Uh, nope, not close enough. Not close enough. Ugh. That's not gonna be good. 
place is safe. Okay. We got like a professor combo going here. They're not together very much, but uh Let's see what I can do with the professor. Damn it. Damn it. Uh, and I weaken up the way that I would do it. Can I get them together? Yes. All right. I got that one there. This one's not going to work out so well. Spawned in a little bit too quick. There. Yeah. And you turn around. See, this is the finish line. And then, like I said, you can start building up like a combo here, but. Piece of the universe. Alright, we'll try that. Try that. Is that close enough? Yes, it is. Yes, it is. So I got another one. It's another combo. Just take Scott over. Did I get a combo there? I didn't get a combo? They were so close together, though. Hopefully that is Finally far made. enough apart. Yeah, I'm not gonna get it this time either. Nope. This is the finish line. Nope. Only got 22. <laughs> Made it. Maybe a change of perspective will help. Maybe if I do it from this side. I don't see how it would. What am I doing spawning you in so fast? Now you're like useless to me. Unless I do that. Right, then. Let's give this a try. Okay. Wait for it, wait for it. <laughs> there we go. Hey, I got the combo. That somehow worked out. Really wanna do this. Okay, is that good? Is that good? That's close. Yes, that worked. That worked. Give it a try. All right, they spawn right on top of each other. That is what I like to see. All right, so hopefully I can bring you across. No, damn it. There we go. All right, well I got that combo. Yes. All right, at least. I salvaged that. This is the finish line. Wait, I think it was like that. That's that's too late on that one. That is too late on that one. Finally made. Oh yeah, we don't need to know though. Okay. Ah, crap. Just spawn wherever. Hopefully I can get these two together. They're close. I don't think I can do it. Yes! Alright, we got it. No, you stay back. Yeah, I tried. I tried. Oh no! I tried. Alright, spawn. Is that close? I think that's gonna be fun. Okay. We may have this. We may have it this time. If I don't screw this up somehow. Chances are good that I'll find a way. There's always a chance I'll find a way. Wait for it. There. Alright. All right, I got the combo. I think we're good. I don't think I need to worry about combos anymore. 
I just need to worry about getting everybody to the end. Like I said, it's kind of luck-based how that ended up working out well for me. You know, I got a couple natural combos there. Where they just gave me two in a row that were the same color, and they gave me the chance to spawn them in the way that I wanted to. I was lucky on my part. But that should do it! Peace of the universe is safe. That should do it. All right, that's five nine clear. There's one more to go, and this one's actually going to be a relatively easy one, believe it or not. It looks really complicated. This is Sokoban, but Sokoban, I believe is how I'm supposed to say it, uh, which is a, a push puzzle in Japan. Uh, this one's e a lot easier once you know the trick. Uh, there's technically two tricks, but uh, essentially hold uh, the X button and that's it. And then uh, just let them bunch up together. Hopefully they bunch up well for you. So holding the X button will move them over there. And that's essentially all you need to know. <laughs> for the time being, for the time being. Ugh, they're, they're not linked together the way that I would like though. Okay, so what I wanna do is wait till the last one hits that triangle and then hit circle and triangle at the same time and then run. And that's it. Reset and start again. So X, just hold X. And let them all run into that little two by two there. Wait for the last one to hit the triangle. Circle and triangle. And that's it. Looks really difficult and I know I had to look it up, but once I looked it up, Seemingly pretty simple. Pretty simple once you know the trick. But if you don't know the trick, nearly impossible because you need a combo too, right? You need the combo. You need to figure out how to get these guys into a combo when you start. And that is a lot easier said than done. There we go. And that should win it for me. And we have done it! World 5 has been cleared! And I've, I've acquired the Vaquero, or the Vaquero. Either way, all worlds completed. Oh wait, World 6 Master has appeared. Hang in there. There's one more to go. It is not nearly as good of a prize as this one is, if you ask me. But uh, you know what? It's still a good prize, so I will be taking care of that. For the time being, though, we're done here. We're done. I need to recharge before I start taking on World 6, which will probably be a challenge because I haven't done it before. But, we acquired something really good, hopefully. Let's take a look at it. It turns out that it is a weapon for Junior. So right now we're at 39 strength, 39 special attack. You can kind of ignore the 10 vitality. 39, 39, the Vaquero, the Vaquero. 82, 82. It's Junior's ultimate weapon so I'm gonna go ahead and equip that and you might see junior in the party for a little bit he is now my strongest character by actually quite a bit coast was at 121 Ziggy's at 120 Jin who if you remember had a really good weapon is at 117 I don't think he's yet. yeah he doesn't have anything better than that Junior's is at 147 though yeah he's the best character attack wise that I have right now and I do plan on utilizing that and he's also got a hell of a lot of special attack which I will also take advantage of yeah no it's not the final stage Spumoni you're a liar you know that but with that done it is actually recorded that is going to do it for these parts of Let's Play Xenosaga. I've been joined, as always, by my surrealistic puzzle game squad of Momo, Cosmos, Chaos, Shion, Ziggy, Jin, and Junior, but primarily with the avatars, so to speak, of Alan, the Professor, Assistant Scott, and Miyuki. Hope you guys have enjoyed these parts. Hope you laughed. Hope you learned. Hope to see you next time. Thanks for watching.